making his major league debut. Number 11, Anthony Volpe. Number 11. All Anthony has ever wanted to be was shortstop for the New York Yankees. Here he is. And he takes the walk. There he goes. Pitch is high. Throw to second. It's a stolen base. There it is. A perfect opening day as the Yankees win 5 0. I went to high school and everything in Jersey, but I grew up almost up until then in the city. And I mean, my dream was the same dream as probably every kid that I grew up with. I bet over half the kids in the class said the Yankees play or stuff like that. My dad, when we lived in the city, worked in Jersey. And then when we lived in Jersey, my mom worked in the city. They worked super hard. Definitely grateful that they're my parents. It's a dream, but you don't know how to go from point A to point B at all. You just say it and you believe it and you want it to happen. Stolen base for Anthony Volpe. Volpe's gonna score. When there became like a roadmap, it became attainable. Payoff pitch is lined into left field, down the line for a base hit. Volpe on his way to second base. It kind of turned from a dream to a goal. Hit in the air well towards left field, chasing back Valera over towards the warning track, and it bangs off the bottom of the wall. It's an RBI double to break this score open. That's when I feel like it became attainable, but there's a lot of work to be put in. Here go, going back to the warning track, to the wall, it's gone! It was super motivating when it became a goal. Welcome to New York. <laughs> <laughs> I was texting my mom, I didn't know where she was. They were in Tampa, just watching spring training, everything like that. My heart was beating pretty hard. Armenian relations grabs me, he's like, hey, there's some people in the dugout. And I turned and it was my parents, Poppy, and a couple other friends and family. To a certain extent, I feel like I've settled in, in at least into the city and into the clubhouse and stuff like that, but I don't really think I don't think it's really hit me. This is all our dream, and for it to start to become reality, it's, it's hard to even put the words. It's as unique as you could possibly get. Tops and collecting plays a huge role in getting people into the game and learning about players. And all the batting cages I'd ever go to when I was little in the city. You ask your dad for a pack of cards on your way out. Right after the draft, you gotta sign a bunch of cards and it's so cool and so much fun. And then you see yourself on the card. And I think your major league debut is such a culmination of everything and everyone that's helped you get to that point. For the player, I think it's so special because the odds of making it is so rare. And It'll always just give them a connection to me and me a connection to them. I think that's why it's so good for the game. And anytime you can make a personal connection to a fan, I think goes a long way. I got sleep, but I like, don't really know if I got sleep the night before. They put me up in the hotel and I kind of drove up the West Side Highway. I literally passed fields that I played on right on Riverside Drive. I remember thinking how cool and how crazy that was. There was so much excitement and there's so many family and friends there. The whole Del Barton baseball team was there. I think the whole library was set up and there was a bunch of people watching. As soon as we took the field and I threw the first ball across the infield in warm-ups, then I was good. And then it was like the greatest day ever. At the end of the day, it's the same game I've played since I was little. It's the same now, it's just on a bigger stage, which makes it a lot more fun. 2-2 pitch is blasted high out toward left field. Track, wall, see ya! First home run of the big leagues, Anthony Volpe! This one hit high in the air towards right field. It is 2-0 Yankees! High fly ball from the track at the wall. See ya! A grand slam for the kid! 
up all of a sudden. This is become an old hat for Anthony Volpe. Going to third is Volpe. The first Yankee rookie to have 20 home runs and 20 stolen bases in a season. Just the idea of having something that commemorates that for the fans is next level.